Hi, I'm Reggie with Stupid Raisins. In this video, I will show you three ways how to change duration of transition in Final Cut Pro. So let's get it on! Okay, let's start with the first method. So once you have your transition on your clips, just select your transition and then hit Ctrl D. So once your time display becomes purple, you can now enter the duration you want, okay? So this is the hours, the minutes, the seconds, and the frames. Okay, so once it's purple, just hit the duration you want on your keyboard. Gonna hit 200, zero, zero. 2 seconds and 0 frames. And then hit enter. Okay, so the durations now change. Mmm, look at the pizza. Oh yeah. By the way, if you hit Ctrl D and you entered a wrong duration, just click on your timeline and then it will reset. Okay? Just click your transition again and then Ctrl D and enter the duration you want. Okay? Okay, for the second method, so you can also change the duration of your transition by dragging. As you can see, 2 seconds becomes 3 seconds. Okay? So that's how you change the duration by dragging. By the way, the duration of your transition is dependent with the remaining frames of your clips. Okay? To see that, just double click the transition. There you go. So I've already put markers. So these markers indicate the last frame of the clips and then the first frame of the second clip. Okay? So the duration is dependent with the remaining frames right here. So from the marker, I'm just gonna hit shift right arrow to move 10 frames. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So I have extra 50 frames on the first clip and then 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 50 frames on the second clip. Then I can just drag this transition right here, but it will end at the last frame right there. Okay, so the maximum will be right here. So that's the maximum duration you can set. Okay, did you get it? Okay, let's see how it looks. Oh, look at the jizz. Mm. Oh, yeah. Mm -mm. Look at the pizza bouncing. By the way, I have a video about how to put markers. Just click up in this corner right now to check it out. Okay. If this video has been helpful to you, go ahead and hit that like button. I would really appreciate it. For the third method, just go to your menu, select Final Cut Pro, and then hit Preferences, and then go to Editing, and then you have your transition right there. So this is the default duration of your transition. Okay, let's make it 3, then Exit. Whenever you insert the transition, I'm gonna hit Command T. The default duration of the transition will be 3 seconds. Okay? Okay. Mmm, mmm. Thank you for watching and I hope you learned something today. If you want to learn more, I've made a video about how to add fade transition in Final Cut Pro. Click here to check it out.